So I was meditating today and God dropped something in my spirit and it, and it, was, it, was, it was good. Everything God gives you is good. And I was like, Lord, what do you want me to do? You want me to hold on to this? You want me to do? He's like, no, put it out there. And I was like, Lord, do you want me to do something? He's like, no, just put it out there. So I'm going to go ahead and be obedient to the spirit of God. And Isaiah 61 and 1 in the King James Version, it said, the spirit of the Lord is upon me. The spirit of the Lord is upon me. And then the next word is because. That was it. It's like the spirit of the Lord is upon me because. What is your because? What is the reason that the spirit of the Lord is upon you? Why? What? What is What is it that God has put inside of you? What seed has God put in the inside of us that makes the spirit of the Lord be upon us? The spirit of the Lord comes upon us to help us to bring forth that seed, to bring forth that harvest. What is it the gift that God sent you here with is basically what God was telling me. I look at John the Baptist. I look at his gift preaching in the wilderness. He went out into the wilderness. And he preached the guy and he preached a message, a simple message, but the spirit of the Lord was upon him to call people to repentance. And in and, and Isaiah, he said, the spirit of the Lord is upon me because he has anointed me to preach the gospel, the good news to people who are in bondage, people that are in chain. And I'm paraphrasing people that are in bondage, people that are, are in chain, people that want to hear something different. What is this your gift that God has given you? The spirit of the Lord is upon you. Why? What is it God wants to get out of you? What is it that God wants to get out of me? And he, he showed me this so clear today. I was like, okay, God, I receive it. I thank you for it. But what is the spirit of God upon you for? The spirit of the Lord is upon you. Why? Man, we got so much more coming, man. Um, my brothers that use the hop on hearts and man, they got some things going on, man. But I got some things going on myself and my wife. So just stay tuned. But I wanted to get this out here. Like I said, I just wanted to be obedient. Why is the spirit of the Lord upon you? The spirit of the Lord is upon me because why? What is it that God has put in the inside of you? What is it God that put inside of me? And once you find out what that is, you need to be watering it. You need to put your resources to it. This is bigger than a job. This is bigger than uh, a savings account. This is bigger than anything that we can imagine because that's the seed. That's why God created you. That's why God comes to visit you to get whatever he put in the inside of you out. That's the harvest that God wants when he returns from you. What is it that I put in the inside of you? What is it that caused the spirit of the Lord to come upon you? Because once that spirit of the Lord come upon you, you need to be activated. We need to be pouring our resources there. We need to be putting our energy there. We need to be focusing on that. And I'm just excited, man. I'm excited for what God is doing in my life, what God is doing in your life. And like I said, with this channel, man, just stay tuned. We got more stuff coming out, man. And uh, until the next time.